7 major DC characters that the Arrowverse is banned from using. Even with flagship series Arrow departing next year, the TV universe it originated you the Arrowverse you is continuing to expand. Not only is a bat, there are plenty of candidates to potentially lead this new roster of shows you the Birds of Prey, the JSA, the Denizens of Star City 2040 you but even now, there are still some DC characters who the Arrowverse is forbidden to touch. The business of which characters can and cannot be used is murky, and, it seems, constantly in flux you both Superman and his nemesis Lex Luthor were originally on the band list, but a deal was later struck to have them appear on Supergirl. As it stands, though, these are the characters which have been ruled out of appearing on any Arrowverse shows, old or new, anytime soon. He's the focus of Fox's prequel series Gotham and cameoed on DC Universe's Titans, but the Arrowverse still can't go anywhere near the Dark Knight. Following years of sly nods to the character, Batman's status in the verse was finally established in last year's Elseworlds crossover once the Guardian of Gotham City, he disappeared sometime in 2015 and is now believed by many to have only ever been an urban legend. The introduction of Batwoman in that same crossover led to fans hoping that Bruce Wayne would be next. But Arrow writer Ke- For now, the comics giant wants Matt Reeves' upcoming big screen take on the caped crusader to be the only screen version. Wonder Woman the Arrowverse is waiting for you, and the powers you possess. And, by the sounds of things, ITLL keep on waiting. Back in 20 Sep, Legends has featured the Isle of Themis Sira itself, but that's likely as good as we're getting. Again, there have been cheeky winks to the various iterations of Green Lantern Hal Jordan's been alluded to on The Flash, while the Elseworlds crossover featured a nod to the long-standing fan theory that Arrow's John Diggle is a version of comic book GL John Stewart. But don't expect any version of the character to be lighting up the Arrowverse anytime soon Mark Guggenheim ruled out Green Lantern in the same interview where he dashed our Wonder Woman hopes, with the long gestating Green Lantern core movie still said to be in development as of mid-2018. Two years before Margot Robbie's performance in Suicide Squad was hailed as the best thing in an otherwise very bad movie, Arrow had Harley Quinn make a cameo in a season 2 episode, also called Suicide Squad. Glimpsed only in Shadow, Harley was voiced by Tara Strong, Wode previously played the character in various DC animated projects and the Arkham Asylum video games. But if there were any plans to feature the character more prominently, they never came to fruition, with Arrow actress Willa Holland suggesting that the show had been forced to axe. With Robbie's Harleen Quinzel still a big part of DCS movie plans, don't expect them to budge on this for the foreseeable. Interesting Arrowverse factoid Arrow had originally planned for its third season to introduce DC character Ted Kord, alias the Blue Beetle, as a new vigilante, love interest for Felicity and love rival for Oliver. But the rights to the character proved to be unavailable, so Brandon Routh ended up playing Ray Palmer slash The Atom instead, and the rest is, quite literally, history. We. No live-action Blue Beetle project has emerged in the five years since, though there was talk in 2015 of a team-up movie that would've seen the character paired with another DC hero, Booster Gold. Not one of the most high-profile DC characters, but Mark Guggenheim told Discussing Film in 2017 that he felt that Vigilante the question would. The Masked Sleuth, though, was apparently being held back for other screen projects. It's. His home of Hub City has been referenced on both Arrow and Legends though. Bit of an odd one, this given that Slade Wilson slash Deathstroke as played by gravel voiced man Mountain Manu Bennett has appeared in 39 episodes of Arrow and was notably the show's big bad across its second season. But plans for the character to appear in his own movie and as the antagonist in Matt Reeves The Batman meant that DC put the kibosh on any more small screen outings following Bennett's appearance in the 2017 Arrow episode Promises Kept. Oddly enough, the character will be appearing in Season 2 of Titans, played by S.A. Morales, but that doesn't necessarily mean that the Arrowverse ban has been lifted you after all, 
Titan somehow got its mitts on Batman, too. Related A23 of the greatest DC characters Microsoft guess. <laughs> Stop smoking, no cooking the hot pot. Fucking on your bitch, yeah, that, that, that.